So I went to the heavy equipment show in Kamloops this weekend and I wanted to show you the difference between a Canadian made and manufactured piece of logging equipment and a piece of construction equipment that's been adapted to forestry. Start with, let's have a look at this log loader. You see on the top here, the entire top section opens to give you a platform to work on everything. Compared to this machine where you have to work on everything behind these two doors. Look how easy that is to get at and service your hydraulic pump in this thing. Like you need to do any work on your engine, you just walk in here on these platforms, there you go, you're able to work on it. Now compare that with this hydraulic pump underneath there, and then if you want to get in and work on the motor, you either need to remove these panels and unbolt them, or you got to work in this tiny little space in there. Like check it out, what other excavator do you see that has a walkway on the back of your counterweight so you can work on whatever you need to back here? Rather than those doors you seem to access, look at the door on the back of this machine. Once you lift that lid up, you can physically just walk into the back of your excavator and service everything you need to service from a walking platform. I'll never understand why regular excavators don't just lift their lid like this. Like you have a full walkway to set your tools down when you're working. It also has a spare hydraulic tank right there, so you don't need to carry extra buckets with you. You have spare fluid. And once again, nice huge walkway so you can service absolutely everything. Even give you nice grab handles when you're walking on it too. The inside quality is way better. All those panels are steel and bolted on. Plus you have these nice and easy to service electrical boxes, something we're definitely sealing for the Edison truck. At the end of the day, ask your field mechanic which machine you'd rather work on. Simpler is always better.